Welcome to the MapInfo Discover webinar series. The presentation will start shortly. Another thing is what usually happens when you are working with one of these maps, you go in and you take a look at it and you say, you know, I need to go in here and make a couple of changes. And the first thing that you do is you go back to your map window and you zoom in or zoom out, in which case then your layout has changed because both of these windows are linked. And so you hear people say various and assorted things when that happens. So let's take a look at a couple of ways that you can fix that. And we've got a couple of things that we can do. So the first thing would have been if you had had the scaled output open, there is an option there to restore the map window but we've already closed that. So let's take a look at two other options that are available to us. One is through Discover and the other is through one of the tools that's available with MapInfo. So with Discover, what you can do is you can go to Map Window and you can say Save Mapper State right here. So it has saved this, this view of the map window. Now what we can do is zoom in and we can move things around and then if we want to come back and return to our previous view, what we would do then is say restore mapper state and then it brings everything back to the way it was. Another thing that we can do using enhanced layer control, which is a nice feature, let's go ahead and turn the layout window back on so you'll see that things are looking as expected. If you have zoomed in or zoomed out, you do have the enhanced layer control previous view. So let's take a look at doing that. So what I'm just going to do is zoom out and now what I can do is say previous view and it's brought me back to, it's zoomed back in to the the window the way that it would be expected for the layer control here. One other option that, that we had all used before Discover came around is one of the Tools menus. So let's go to Tool Manager. And what we're going to do is we're going to go down and find our Named View. So let's see where that is. Here's our Named View and you can see I've already turned that on. Another feature we're going to be working with is the North Arrow, so I'm just going to turn that on now so that we can take a look at that in a minute. So let's go ahead and say OK. And now if I go up to Tools, I've got an option here that says Named View, and I can select Named Views. So what I can do is I can add a view, and I can just call this something again that makes sense to me and I'm going to add that to my view here right here and I can say close now and so if I move this I can then come back to my tool menu to named views and go to Sylvania so then it's brought it back again so you've got several options of getting back to where you need to be when you have zoomed in or zoomed out or panned around in your map window, but you've got to be thinking about that first because if you haven't set it, that's one of the first places that you can really get in trouble because these two windows are linked. So let me go ahead and close named view and we're going to bring our layout view back and make sure that things are looking the way they are. So those are a couple of options that you've got that are available to you. This concludes the seminar. For additional information on webinars and training services, visit our website at http www.geographicsworld.com or contact us at 520-744-4457.